So this one is really cool. This is a gall on a mushroom. This is a shelf fungus that grows on a tree. My favorite galls are these one on oaks because they're super easy to spot in nature and like everybody already saw them but never realized what it's really are. And this actually is the oldest of the gall specimens that we have in our entire collection. Also really good spot in nature and so really interesting for all people out there are the galls from the Rosea. It's like a big fuzzle ball. <laughs> really funny. So galls come in all shapes and sizes. They look really different. Every interaction between an insect and a plant creates a different shape. And so you can often tell what kind of insect made it just by looking at it. Gallen werden von den verschiedensten Lebewesen ausgebildet, die es gibt, die man sich vorstellen kann. Es gibt Wespen, es gibt Fliegen und Mücken, ähm, sogar kleine Fadenwürmchen, Pilze oder auch Pflanzen können Gallen ausbilden. Letztendlich hat man einfach ganz viel Halligalli in der Galle.